find those that are engaged in groundbreaking endeavors, even if they be at their infancy today, but clearly with a very bright and interesting future ahead of them. If you are not already a Business Day reader on our digital platforms, we would like for you to be a Business Day reader on our digital platforms. I mean, that is the list that we will be, you know, offering here this afternoon. Um, so let's be friends, if we are not friends already. But most importantly, enjoy the experience today. Thank you very much for coming. God bless you. That I would like to introduce um, Mr. Abayomi Awobukum. Um, he's a business leader um, from Nigeria, 2016 recipient of the Young Global Leader Award from the World Economic Forum, 2017 recipient of the prestigious Archbishop Desmond Tutu Fellow from the African Leadership Initiative and South Africa. And he's the founder of the September 20th Foundation, as well as the CEO of Enio Retail, of course. So I'll be um, running, some, running, running through some questions. There's a ton of questions that SMEs have, um, but I've just captured a few. And um, um, yeah, so we'll just start. So you're welcome. Thank okay. you. Good afternoon, everybody. So what, what can I address you as? Yomi. OK, Yomi. Thanks to Business Day and everybody concerned uh, in putting this together. It's a huge, huge privilege to be here. The biggest challenge, or the biggest challenges, are around a, 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 an even playing field. Uh, I think that's the best way to put it. It's that as a startup or an SME, unfortunately, you are not competing against uh, brighter minds. You're competing against entrenched interests. Startup, but I had a first startup that I built, and it, it did go as planned. And, and that, that put me in a position where I was completely worn out. Uh, I thought we did everything we could have done. But you know when you've read books and then life teaches you real lessons, and then all those things you read in those books, all of a sudden you start asking yourself, did they adulterate you? Theories in this book, so something. Tech is enabling medicine, tech is enabling finance, tech is enabling everything. So I think the, the, the whole world has been eaten up by tech. So any, any, any business you're in today that tech has not enabled you, just hold on a moment, it's going to get to you. The problem is when it comes to your side, are you going to survive? Because as it goes along, it kills whatever comes along with it. Oh, <laughs>